Election day less than eight weeks away. Yep, and tonight people got the chance to ask the candidates for Wake County Sheriff questions in a candidates forum in both Spanish and in English. And CBS 17's Gilat Malamed is live there at the Justice Center tonight with what those candidates have to say. We're just two months away from election day here. Just two months away, and Donnie Harrison and Willie Rowe are similar. Both have had decades long careers in law enforcement. Harrison, a former sheriff for 16 years, Rowe, a former major, but there are some differences they want voters to know about. Willie Rowe and Donnie Harrison are making their cases for being Wake County's top law enforcement officer. Lace Latino and El Centro Hispano hosted a forum Wednesday night, a big topic, 287G, an agreement between ICE and local law enforcement agencies where the local agency enforces federal immigration law. Harrison signed on to it as sheriff, but now says he would not reinstate the program. According to what I've been told, 287G is a thing of the past. I would not reinstate the program. Beyond 287G, we asked Harrison what he'd do differently this time around. Time change. It's law enforcement changes. What I'll do is work to keep everybody safe again, pick out the best programs that we can, train them, uh, get as many people as we can to work for us. We asked Roe what he'd do differently than his predecessor when it comes to reducing crime. Well, one of the things we're going to do is be more proactive. We're going to put our deputies in the community, and we're going to have community engagement. Why did you fail to maintain integrity? Another challenge the new sheriff will face a series of internal and external concerns raised following Deputy Ned Bird's murder. Multiple Wake County commissioners tell CBS 17 they've received several complaints from citizens about it. We asked how the candidates will restore morale and the public's trust. I'll be out front. I'll be looking out to my personnel. I'll be listening to the public. I'll be visible, and people can get up with me anytime they want to. I'm walking around, being engaged, providing uh, wise counsel, advice, surrounding myself with people so that we can put forth the right structure that will improve morale. In eight weeks, voters will decide who they think will do the best job. Another big topic is school safety. Both candidates trust collaborating with groups like the school board. Harrison says he wants to see a school police force instead of having multiple agencies oversee the current SRO program. Rose stresses security like cameras and locked doors. Live in Raleigh, Gilat Malamed, CBS 17 News. All right, Gilat, thank you.